Hey there everyone, it is the one and the only, once again, it is Team Rai Rai, how you doing? I'm getting better, I hate this freaking head cold, just have patience with me, and eventually I'll get my normal voice, but like I said yesterday, the show must go on, and here goes nothing, I'm going to discuss wrestling news, wrestling topics, and a lot of awesome topics. So sit back, relax, grab something to drink, grab something to eat, because this will be a very interesting podcast. Here goes nothing. Now, this past Sunday was a shocking return of the future Hall of Famer, in my opinion, Rey Mysterio. We have not seen Rey Mysterio in, a, in a quite a few years, okay? He looks good, great shape. And I'm glad he was back for that one-time moment, you know. He had his spot, and it was great to see the 619. You know, his 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 finishing move. <clears throat> he has the other one, but that's more famous. Anyway, I've been um, discussing about Rey Mysterio, okay. Now, okay, I'm going to give you a little article. I'm not going to read a whole article because it will take forever. Okay. I'm going to say this. Everyone thought that he's going to sign excuse me, with Impact Wrestling. Now, because he was not able to free and clear from the other wrestling promotion contract until middle of January, that's why. So that really sucks for him. But, the headliner says... The door is open for Rey Mysterio return to WWE. Okay, it's a backstage report. So, that's great, you know. Now, if he does come back, you know, it would be a perfect fit for him. 205 Live, okay. He's a freaking cruiserweight. And the guys they have now, it's okay. But maybe he'd be, he'd help the young guys out. They need more guys like that, you know. I mean, they high flyers, but not the ones that I remember, like Ultimate Dragon, Rey Mysterio, um, um, who else? Cruz, I mean, um, Eddie Guerrero, um, Junior, not Junior, his nephew, uh, Chavro, there you go. And the guys they have now, I cannot really get into it. You know, like, I can feel the vibe. I think, my opinion, uh, my opinion only, I know a lot of you are going to dislike it. Those guys are not really cruise weights. Maybe they are. Maybe they aren't. I don't know. Maybe I'm just stuck in the good old days. But if from this article, if this is literally legit or not legit, now if the doors are open for him to return, that's perfectly fine. I don't know if he's going to sign a full-time contract with W or a part-time contract. Excuse me, I don't want to sneeze. <clears throat> From my point of view, give me a full time contract or scratch that. Maybe a part time. Because he's not young anymore and his age, and he can't do them high flying things anymore. Actually, he did it this past Sunday, so that kind of proved me wrong. So I think put him in 205, help the younger guys to get over. He's way better, in my opinion, than um, Neville, in my opinion. He's way better than Nunzimore. Both guys are not with W anymore. They, they screw themselves in the foot. And that's how it is, you know? So I'll put the full article down below. Now, if he does come back, we'd like to get him come back. Go strictly to 205 Live, go back to SmackDown, you know, SmackDown Live this time, or to Raw. My possibility, if I was the the guys who bring in Ray Mysterio, put him in 205 for a little bit, then eventually go back to SmackDown. But this time it'll be SmackDown Live. But probably it won't work with SmackDown Live because there's no cruiserweights in that <clears throat> brand. But the thing I don't understand about 205, why do they have to have it on Raw? That's why I don't understand it. 
keep 205 and 205 live that's it you know they don't need no, no special airtime for freaking raw you know that's why I don't watch 205 live to, to avoid 205 live you know but that's W's fault the creators the creators of bookers are idiots they are but they just do their job and they are all good stuff sorry I gotta stop this right now because um I can't talk to you very well but the show must go on hopefully I get better <clears throat> sorry about that so I'll put the article down below like subscribe favorite leave a comment and what do you think about the article do you think Rey Mysterio will come back to WWE do you think eventually he will just go to other promotionals for other deals you know so I think eventually he will go back to WWE I don't know when, but we'll find out. Maybe next weekend, maybe the week after. Who knows? But I think that we will sign him for a part-time contract. Have a good one, and I'll see you guys next podcast. Thank you very much for listening. If you watched, if you list, if you're listening from earlier, check that one out earlier. If you missed out later, have a good one.